Hey everybody, Reverend Fuzzy here again, but I guess you noticed that already. <laughs> you know, some people were asking me, Reverend, why is there evil in the world? You know, it's a difficult question for many people. The simplest way to look at this question is to examine God's nature and his desire for mankind. And look at the logic. God loves us and wants us to love him back. And how could we love him back unless we have the freedom to not love? God could have made us like robots who do nothing more than say, I love you, I love you, I love you. But we'd be forced to do that and that wouldn't be real love. Love is a choice. And if you have a choice, you have to be able to choose not to love. That in itself is the nature of evil. Evil is choosing not to love. So when God gave us the freedom to choose, he gave us not only our greatest blessing, but he also gave us our greatest curse. We can choose to do the right thing or choose to do the wrong thing. So the reason there's evil in the world is not because of God, but because God gave us the freedom to choose. Now the potential for love outweighs the existence of evil, because you see, evil is only going to exist for a short time, but love is going to go on forever. And all the suffering and all the death that we see in the world today are because the inhabitants of this planet have chosen to make wrong choices. God could have taken our freedom, but he didn't. I hope you'll use your freedom to choose God. Okay, everybody, I'm gonna take off for now, but before you go, don't forget to show us some love and smack that like button. And if you haven't already done so, also smack that subscribe button, followed by smacking the notification bell, so you'll be notified when we post new videos on here. Alright, catch y'all later.